Hello Rebel Nation, I'm your Athletics Director Ross Bjork. We are excited to be playing at home after a very productive bye week. Our coaches, staff, and student athletes are ready to lock the bot against LSU Saturday at 2.30 p.m. This video continues our commitment to communicating the three most important things about football weekends, so let's get started. The first of the three things is about our senior class. These young men have helped lead Ole Miss football back to national prominence and represented us with class and excellence. With a bowl appearance, this Ole Miss senior class will be the first to go to four straight bowl games since the class of 2000. Their four-year win total of 31 and counting is the best since the 2003 seniors had 31 wins. We saw back-to-back -back wins over Alabama for the first time in school history, as well as wins at Alabama and Auburn in the same season for the first time in program history. They were part of the number one scoring defense in the country last year and set a school record for total offense in 2013. Those are just some of the highlights, so please make sure to get to your seats early so you can honor these young men and their families during our Senior Day Ceremony. The second of the three things is about counterfeit tickets. We have been alerted to a small number of counterfeit tickets being sold online and on game day. Before the Arkansas game, we had a number of fans who purchased invalid tickets in the Grove and outside the stadium. We don't want any of our fans becoming a victim of fraud, so if you do not have tickets, please make sure you purchase from an authorized ticket reseller like Vivid Seats. For your protection, we recommend only purchasing tickets online from those that include a buyer guarantee that will allow for a full refund if those tickets are invalid. We do not recommend buying from individuals in the Grove or outside the stadium as none of those transactions are guaranteed. Last, because of an increased security presence, we encourage you to arrive at the gates early as lines may be long close to kickoff. The last of the three things is related to the north end zone. It's hard to believe that Saturday will be our final home game of 2015, marking the end of the existing north end zone. Construction to complete the seating bowl will begin immediately, and the vault will look much different when we open next season on September 10th. Not only will the stadium be completed, three new video boards and a sound system will be installed, the plaza outside the pavilion will be complete, the south end zone club will be fully operational, and much more. I want to thank Rebel Nation for your unwavering support of Ole Miss Athletics. Without you, none of this would be possible. As always, if you have questions about these three things or anything else about our program, please visit OleMissSports.com and click the Ask Ross link at the top of the page so we can answer those on Studio 18. We are grateful for your incredible passion as Rebel fans and thank you for your continued support of Ole Miss Athletics. Be early, be especially loud, and let's lock the bot this Saturday.